Hey guys, Jason here with Bounce Water Inflatable Sales. We're out in front of our shop here. We're going to show you real quick today how to fold and roll the 18 foot center climb paradise balls. They're all going to be done the same way if they're a center climb, whether it be 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 foot. They're all kind of, uh, the zippers are all in the same spot, so they'll all come down the same way. The idea of where to throw the lanyards in and all that kind of stuff will all be the same. And if you'll notice too, it's kind of hard to see, but you'll see how we hose it up top. We just simply, right above the netting, we'll strap in the hose up top there. It's just a regular garden hose and drill small holes very close apart across the hose over the lanes. And then the hose will just dip down off the side as well. That'll give you an idea on how that actually works. And then you can plug right here. You can go right into your customer's hose. It keeps everything really simple. You don't have to worry about misting systems that clog up or that sort of thing. You got some extra here. And you'll see when we go to roll up that we'll just toss this in a long about way off throughout the unit, roll it right up into the unit. It's a nice flexible hose. You don't need a super expensive hose. Just a uh, $12, 50 foot guard But at any rate, Rudy, if you want to go ahead and come back here, you're going to see um, two blower tubes. And that comes with any of our units that you can uh, decide to hook from here. So we'll just simply turn off the blower. And you can watch them work around it. And there is a, a multitude of zippers in the back. We'll unzip to get this thing to come down. There's also a point at the top there. And also on the back, you have zippers as well. So we'll let that air out really good. And then in part two of this video, the unit is now down. We'll show you how to tuck everything in, put in the straps, and our method of rolling them, and uh, run through that with you. Thanks so much for your time. Give Bounce Water a call at 813-947-5002. Hey guys, this is part two of rolling up the 18 foot Paradise Falls center climb. Again, works the same on any center climb units. Uh, 16 foot, 15 foot, doesn't matter, it all works the same. So these guys will show you how they're gonna do it. As you can see here, they're pulling in the palm trees and walking them out. I'll move around the unit some. The hose that was hanging off the side, as you can see, they wrapped up and they put in inside the unit. They're going to proceed to pull the back of the unit, all the material from the back, square. And if you walk back here, just a little bit, you'll see that you want the back seam of the unit completely pulled forward to be square. You see how the square is happening in the back? That's the back seam. Take your lanyards after you pull it forward and just lay them in the back side of the unit. If you throw them in earlier than that, when you blow it up, at times they'll hang up and not let the unit go up, and then you have to blow it back down and take the lanyard up. If you do it this way, when you blow it up, they fall right off the back nice and easy. If you come to the front, you're going to see that they're going to pull the pool back to the seam of where the pool goes, which is right there. So now, as you can see, you're developing a good size square. You've got the back square and the pool square. If you look here and you're wondering, we do have a bottom liner. We particularly cut them out. We don't use them because we have a six mil pull liner. They're not really needed. Doesn't mean you need to do that if you like the bottom liner. But you can see here where we cut ours out. We, my drivers just don't feel a need to have them in there. Our liners are thick enough not to get hurt. 
So they're going to come to the side over here, as you can see, and go halfway over. Now, we roll our units a little bit differently than a lot of other companies. We need room in the trailer, so we roll them a little taller, usually about four head high or so. Same thing in our storage building. So we're going to go half over and the other half halfway over that rather than half, half, and half. This side's going to come and meet over top of the other side right about there. Okay, That's going to make the roll a little taller, um, but it, it makes it a little more conducive to manage on the dolly. It gets it up on the dolly higher. Uh, downside to a little taller is when you have to lift it off the ground, you have to go up a little higher. Upside is easier to manage on the dolly, with more units in the trailer and also in your shop. So we'll set the straps here, undo the air pockets in the bottom. pretty much ready to roll. We have an inflatable roller which works very well. So they'll just simply start the roll and just roll it from there. But as you can see it's a pretty simple setup. You have a nice square unit. You roll we roll back to front. Um, the reason we do that is to get the bulk of the mass out of the way first down to the pool. And if there's any water left in the pool it would actually come out. My name is Jason with Bounce Water Sales. Hope the video helped. Uh, if you need a new unit or just have a question about rolling any unit or anything we can help you with, we're happy to help. Give me a call at 813-947-5002. Have a great day.